Hey everybody, this is the Blue Dude Gamer, and today we're going to be playing some Subnautica. I have had this game for a little while, but I, you know, I haven't put too much time into it. Um, so, I mean, this is, for the most part, it's going to be a fairly blind playthrough. I'm going to play on, uh, I, uh, Freedom, I suppose. Um, I don't know, I don't want to have to eat and drink, I know, um, it's kind of a cop-out, but... Whatever. I'm going to, uh, most likely just cut through this loading screen, so. so it usually takes a while. Ah, oh, that wasn't bad. In the late 22nd century, humanity is beginning to colonize space. Before colony ships arrive, habitation vessels are appointed terraforming missions. The Aurora was one such vessel. During its descent, the Aurora was struck by a mysterious energy pulse resulting in catastrophic hull failure. A single life pod jettisoned prior to impact. You were in that life pod. Well, all right. <clears throat> Again, I haven't played in, you know, quite some time, so I don't, you know, really know how to play too much. Glass, magnesium, diamonds, power cells, blueprints. Uh, sorry for any background noise. I mean, it's it's early in the morning, like, uh, like six, I think. 6.30, Scanning 6.30. The Aurora, zero life signs detected. Scanning Relief the detected. The main drive core has malfunctioned. The primary dark matter containment field has dropped to 36% amplitude. Gotta get some popcorn. Continuing to monitor. Continuing to monitor, okay. Uh, the thing with these kind of games, this and Stranded Deep, this is kind of a little bit worse. Um, uh... Not not less fun, but just scarier, I guess. Um, oceans to me are like like horror games. Like this is worse than Outlast to me. Uh, so I don't really know what what to go. I guess I want to make this thing first. Or wait, no, no, no. I know what I want to make first. Hold on. Tools. I want to make that thing that makes you go fast. The the hell is it called? The uh, tank fins, radiation suit. I mean, I guess fins as well. But flashlight, survival knife, flare, builder, welder, laser cutter, beacon, small storage, gravisphere. Uh, it is called. There'll probably be quite a few cuts in here, just you know, to save on time if I'm not doing anything. So. I do have some stuff, I suppose. I don't, see, I don't know how to make those things, but... Alright. Guess there is one way to find out. Oh! What the hell? Ah! What the fuck? Ah, what the hell? This is why I don't like the ocean. It's gonna kind of be, I guess, like an ex. I don't even know. I don't even know what I'm doing. So uh, I'll pick up that thing. Pick up that thing. Pick up that Emergency. thing. Ten seconds of oxygen oh, oh, remaining. Oh! 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 Okay. First episode, I guess I'm just gonna be gather, just gonna be gathering, you know, a bunch of random items, and I'll try my best to, you know, cut around. Wait, what? <gasps> you can dig. You you can dig. Oh my god. Underwater Minecraft, anybody? <laughs> um. I'm gonna see if I can capture. Wait, can I capture him? Can I get? Can I get you? No. 
no. What about you? <coughs> Nighttime approaches. Oh, I got him! He's so cute! Alright, nighttime approaches. I am not gonna get caught in the middle of the ocean at nighttime. So I will pet today. Caution. Readings from the Aurora suggest erratic fluctuations in the primary dark matter containment field. A breach of the main drive chamber may cause a cascading quantum flux detonation. Sorry, I just wanna wanted to pick back up for uh for that, but <clears throat> while I'm while I'm still here, I mean, just look, just look at this game. I mean, it's it's so pretty, it's so pr oh man, this is so nice. Uh, while I'm waiting for it to be day, I'm just kind of researching some stuff to find out what I need. So that being said, yes. I will be back again. Okay, cool. So now I have, um, I have a tank, so I have more breathing time. Did they make it smaller? I thought it used to take up like eight spaces or something like that. Like, or not eight, but three by three. Um, I don't know. Okay, so <clears throat> I am going to go find more ports. So I guess it's smart to uh. What is this? The ocean, man. It, it it freaks me out, I'm telling you. Ow, ow, ow! What the... Hell, Jesus. Um... Oh, I'm not going in there. Uh, I guess, like, the first time you start in, I mean, this is obviously common sense, is, you know, safe. So they say not to, you know, go too far out without, you know, or without having the right gear. Oh, God. Keep forgetting I need to breathe. Who needs to breathe? God. Um. That is a cool looking knife, I'm not gonna lie. It kind of reminds me of, like, a glass knife out of a, like, uh, what is it? A, a little bit, like Morrowind or something like that. Just a little bit, maybe. Just me. Uh, flippers. Sorry, these noises are freaking me out. Like, I'm, I'm not over exaggerating. All right, it's scary. Maybe I am just a little bit. I don't know if they were trying to make it scary, but it's definitely scary. And it's weird. Okay, so left. Wait. Oh, I'm confused. Right click. Right click is doing this right now. Left click doesn't do anything. Unless I'm up to an object and then left click is to harvest. I have no idea. Warning. Readings from the Aurora. Exhibit characteristics consistent with total degradation of the dark matter containment field. Spikes in quantum fluctuations suggest an uncontrolled cascade detonation will occur, with a probability of 83.5%. Okay. I need... I want to see that thing explode. But I need, uh... Quartz. Where's the... Oh, haha, -ha, quartz. I don't know how much I needed... There it is. I see it. I see it. I see it. I'm not blind. I see it. Oh, what the f- Oh my god. What the hell? I hate oceans. You know what's worse than an ocean? Or than our ocean? An alien ocean. Oh god, what? Oh. <laughs> Nothing. I thought something was coming after me. Oh my god. Okay. 
Okay. Silicone. <coughs> hmm. Emergency. Readings from the Aurora show severe instability in the primary drive core. The central dark matter reactor will reach a supercritical state. A T minus. Ten. Am I gonna die? Eight. Am I gonna die at this distance? Six. Five. Four. I'm gonna die. Two. I gotta watch it. I'm gonna die. That was pretty cool. Sorry, I um I probably cut straight to that explosion. I've just been uh building some stuff, so a lot of this, you know, a lot of this series will probably be me cutting around, you know, some of the stupid crafting and stuff, especially cuz I'm usually focusing um on, you know, that so I'm not really talking, but um <clears throat> I found out that I need two more quartz because I need two silicon and uh two quartz makes one so I, I don't know that's stupid I need two more long story short I need two more left click to pick up the floater Floater. 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 Huh. Okay, I need quartz, man. I need two more quartz. So I can go... Oh, there's one right there. I swear, like, I will scream. Like, you will hear me scream if I get jumped from behind. I'm just warning you now. Turn down your volume. If I get jumped, and it's very likely that it's gonna happen, some fish are gonna... gonna come at me. But first, I have to find some more of the rarest material on Earth, and that's quartz. Sorry, I'm coughing a lot. I'm sick. I'll try to, uh, again, I'll try to cut around that as much as, as much as I can. Uh, salt deposit. And quartz. And more quartz. Some of these and some of those. Oh my god. That's just so beautiful, though. Like... There's just something about this game, like it's definitely got one of the nicest looking oceans, I think. One of the or one of the prettiest looking oceans, I should say. And then that man, like there's just nothing that beats that. But on that note, um I think that's gonna be the end of the first episode one. Uh remember to like, favorite, subscribe, and I will see you guys later. <laughs>